So we've moved to open water now and I just want to show you the functionality of having a Garmin sounder set up used with the Garmin force trolling motor. Now the way I've got this set up is I've got a 7 here at the console and I've also got a 12. The 12 is mainly used for sounding. You can see I've got a, a live scope, side view, clear view and traditional sonar. I use my 7 for my mapping so I can do my contour mapping um, and I'll show you how I quickly do that. If I want to go and record my contours in the lake, all I do is hit uh, menu, you've got quick draw contours and as simple as hitting start recording. So I'm actually recording the contours in the dam. In this particular spot I've got a few uh, little GPS marks that I've put in where I found fish previously. Now over on here on my, my sounder screen, so I've got a G, GPS map, it's an 84 series. What I've actually done is I've set this up, all my sounders are connected wirelessly uh, to my Garmin Force trolling motor. And what I've actually got is I've got my controls for my Garmin Force on the bottom of the screen. Now it's very simple to set that up. So if, I was, if I've got a combo happening here, all I'm going to do is hit menu, I go to edit combo, and then I go to overlays. So if I hit overlays, and it shows me the data that's on the sidebar, the navigation, top bar and bottom bar. So if I want to set it up, I've got this set on the bottom bar. So I go to bottom bar and I can either put a compass tape or my trolling motor bar in. So I've hit that. That'll set up my trolling motor bar down the bottom. So I'll just go back. Now you can see all my um, trolling motor controls here. Now if I'm at the bottom here, I've got my electric down, I'm doing a bit of sounding. If I wanted to, if I'm happy with where I'm at, I can hit anchor and you can see the Garmin Force has just put us in position, we're anchored right here. Now the other cool thing is, all my sounders talk, they're, they're all interconnected. Everything's connected to the Garmin Force trolling motor as well. So on my screen here I've got a couple of GPS marks that I want to go to. So because I've got my trolling motor down and I want to go to this particular mark here. So I click on the screen and it gives me some options and it says, up the top here it says go to. So I'm going to hit go to and that automatically gives me a trail. So on your top bar, I've got the um, trolling motor bar set on the top here and on the bottom down here. You can see down here I've got my trails marker. So I'm going to hit trails. It doesn't matter which screen you do it on. They're all, they're all interconnected. They're all connected to the Garmin Force. Now what it's done is it's lined itself up with that mark. And if I hit go, this one, the force is going to recognise where it is. I've got the power turned up. And what it's doing at the moment is it's just taking us, following that trail, over to where that mark is. Now, as it's moving over there, I can rig a little bit of tackle. I can get myself sorted so I can start fishing. I could obviously use the main motor, but this mark isn't that far away. So it's just automatically going to take me over there. Now, like I said earlier, it's a brushless motor. It's one of the fastest motors that, um, that I've used. You can see we're doing nearly five kilometres an hour and it's taking us over to that position. Now, as we gain on this position, we're actually really quite close. What it'll do very shortly is it'll recognise that we're actually on the mark. We'll just wait for that. And it gives us an arrival alarm. So it's telling us, trolling motor says that you have arrived. So I can go, OK, stop navigation, hit OK. I'm on this mark. Now simply hit the anchor button, and now I'm on the mark. So a really, really cool feature of the Garmin trolling motor paired with your Garmin devices. It's really simply invaluable, um, let alone you know the, the, the whole different array of um, sounding equipment. You've got your Garmin live scope, which you can see here. At the moment you can see some fish swimming through here, you've got some bait, there's fish underneath the boat. Um, you've got your clear view sonar, this one here. You've got your traditional sonar plus your side imaging. There's just so many different options uh, with Garmin nowadays, it's absolutely amazing. Uh, and paired with the Garmin Force trolling motor, it's definitely lethal. So check it out, if you've got any questions let me know, send me a message. And um, there you go, the Garmin Force trolling motor and how I use it.